A local apartment complex is keeping quiet about two armed robberies targeting its residents. And that silence is upsetting to some people who live there. News Channel 15's Adam Widener is live in News Control. Adam, what exactly happened? Well, Heather, in one week, three different people had a gun pointed at them at the Stone Point Village apartment complex. Someone who works for the complex says that employees were told not to say anything about the issue. I'm terrified. We come out here all the time and we didn't know anything about this. December 21st, a man and a woman are robbed at gunpoint at a Stone Point Village apartment. The suspect got away with her purse and his wallet after firing a shot in the air. Demands them to drop a purse, drop their wallet. Seven days later, it happened again. This time, someone pointed a gun at another woman. The suspect got away with her purse and keys. Police think it's the same guy. For whatever reason, Within these seven days, this particular person has pinpointed this area as his area of comfort. For them not to tell us, that's just wrong. Flash forward to today, more than two weeks after the last incident. Residents still have no word from the apartment complex and are slowly finding out through neighbors. It upsets me because I deserve, we all deserve the right to know. This is where we live. This is where we are supposed to feel secure and safe. They're setting out to spread the word personally because their apartment won't. Even if it takes one person standing out and watching that person get in their car safe and drive off, that's what's got to be done. Now you're asked to call Crime Stoppers at 436-STOP if you have any information on the suspect. As for the apartment complex, I tried contacting them or actually did contact them several times today, but no one could tell me exactly why they chose not to alert residents of the incidents. We're live in News Control. Adam Widener, News Channel 15.